Tonight, one of Philadelphia's most powerful lawmakers is under scrutiny. Court documents show the FBI searched the emails of Pennsylvania Congressman Bob Brady. Eyewitness News reporter David Spont joins us now from the SAT Center with more details. David. Jessica, these are those federal documents. Congressman Brady's name is mentioned in this federal search warrant application. But to be clear tonight, he is not indicted. This paperwork indicates that federal agents wanted to search his AOL account for emails. Brady went to Washington as a congressman in 1998. Tonight, his attorney says he plans to stay in Washington. This federal search warrant application details the FBI investigation into emails surrounding Congressman Bob Brady, his associates, and possible involvement into alleged payments to the congressman's opponent in 2012. The payments were allegedly used to convince that opponent, Jimmy Moore, to drop out of the congressional race. Last month, Kenneth Smuckler and Donald Jones, both political consultants, were accused of organizing an illicit $90,000 campaign donation to Brady's opponent to help pay down his campaign debt. But tonight, in this paperwork, Brady's email address is listed as a point of interest for investigators. We reached out to Brady's attorney, Jim Eisenhower, who said in a statement to Eyewitness News, quote, We don't think there's really anything new here. Congressman Brady is not a target of the investigation. We've been cooperating with the Department of Justice for months. The five-year-old emails in question were turned over in April. And tonight, a source with the U.S. Attorney's Office declined to comment on the documents. However, another source says this paperwork may actually signal an end to the investigation. Reporting live tonight, David Spunt, CBS 3 Eyewitness News.